Hi everyone, in this video, I'm going to show you a tutorial for Crayon AI. So first of all, you will have to open a browser. Then here, type in Crayon AI, hit enter. And from there, go to the website. Now once you have the website, you will have to make yourself an account. Now after you made yourself an account, in here, you will have to select your style, a photo, a drawing, a done. We'll just go for let's say a photo now click on this expert mode button right here and it'll give you the negative prompt and in here you can type in the negative prompt as well now if you scroll further down you can get inspirations from the creations of other crayon ai users you can also see some recent creations of other users and this was created just now this one as well this one as well and so on and so forth now in here you would have to type in a prompt for example i'm just going to go for black muscle car just collect the spellings black muscle car part in a parking lot after that, just click on draw. And over some time, it will give you nine images according to your prompt. Now, if you scroll down, it will also give you a detailed prompt according to the prompt that you just gave. For example, it gave me this prompt, a sleek black muscle car enhancing a modern parking garage background. You can try that prompt as well. You can also edit a generated picture, just click on this pen button right here. Now for clicking on that, just scroll down a bit. And in here you will have multiple options, like you can upscale the picture, you can remove its background, you can favoritize it, you can share it, as well as you can download the picture as well. Now if you scroll further down, you will have different details like what prompt was used, what negative prompt was used, what were the details and stuff like that. So you can try out different prompts and different styles to get different results according to your needs and desires. So that's one of it and that's how you can use Crayon AI. Hope you guys liked it. Thanks for watching. Bye.